What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with more Idle Heroes, and today we are going to see what we can do on the Warrior account when it comes to the Dark Sea Land. So, we were able to do a few heroic summons on this account, and we managed to grab one of these cute little girls right here, little Carrie, we got her going there. So, we're going to see how far we can push with an Aspen, a raw army, and carry there just to reduce the uh, the energy, especially on the main boss. So uh, we're going to do something a little different. We're going to take the energy off of Amun-Ra. I'm going to do something like that. Going to put her as the slot one tank, I think. For Aspen, we are going to go with two straight down all the way. This is, uh, this is pretty much what I've seen everybody use for actives on Aspen. We do have a skill damage attack stone, so we are going to use the Punisher of Immortal. So, let's go to carry right here. We're just going to throw on the Ranger gear. Um, Honestly, probably just more damage reduced. We, wanna, we want these heroes to stay alive as long as possible. We will do this with one of you in the back. Let's throw on... Some mixed gear to give more survivability. We're going to have one Amon Ra give energy in the first round. We've got to unlock all these precious stones. Get our 55 attack. <laughs> Let's do it one more time. Throw the gear on this Amon Ra as well as some armor. And the last one as well. Put the gear on. Uh, I guess we're going to have to go the opposite on this one. Not optimal, but it will work with one more fearless armor so the one thing this account really does uh suffer with i guess you should say is lack of energy artifacts there's absolutely no magic sources on this account so it's is a little on the brutal side but we haven't gone too far we're in sea land 14 right now uh let's jump into sea land 15 we're gonna make sure our lineup looks like the way we want it to Let's get all those Amon Ra's in the back. Make sure the pet is good to go as well. I feel like this is going to work. Amon Ra being a slot one tank. I think I think that's the way we're going to have to do. We just got to keep this back line completely topped off. So hopefully we can live the first round and nobody dies in these. But um, yeah, let's see how this goes. We got one layer of shields, which should be good. We'll definitely get a lot of healing right here because we're going to have a ton of layers from Amon Ra. We already popped a lot of them though, so that's not the best. We already have one target down. Carry perfect. If, if Carry can hit the boss in the back every time, I think we'll be golden here. Should get some decent healing on Amon Ra. So far, so good. Um, and now Carrie's going to start hitting the uh, the dragon in the back pretty much every time now because Aspen will kill that. And now with one Carrie, Carrie is a very good support hero in Sealand. Her energy drain will make it so that we never get hit by that huge damage attack the dragon has. And that's the attack that always kills your entire team. So right there. We don't have DA, but CLN 15 down. We just got to hope that our back line stays alive. And if they do, we should survive long enough for Aspen to do all his damage. Oh, that was perfect. That was perfect. Did you see that drained all that energy? Carrie, you are an amazing support here, I will say. She's not here for the damage, that's for sure. But when it comes to her support capabilities, ooh, draining that energy is so integral in this sea land right here. And now, pretty much, I mean, honestly, this dragon will not get a single active off until he's dead. So, Carrie's going to hit right here. Boom, energy down. Yeah, you can try all you want, but <laughs> you're just not going to get that attack off that kills our entire team. Sea land, 15 done. Sealan 16 done. Let's jump into 17. And if this is the case, Carrie's going to make it so that people with Aspens don't need to build a DA anymore. Because really, DA, the only purpose she really had was for Sealan and Broken Space of 7. If you can do without that, you'll be in good shape. 
Oh, we lost one Amon Ra. Not good because we have to go a full round without shields. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, no. Okay, come on. We can do this. We can do this. Aspen, I need you to kill some people here. Oh, no. Too little, too late, I feel like. Although, we'll see if Aspen can handle his own. He'll keep killing him. And then... Oh, man. If Carrie could have revived that next round, we would have been golden right there. Oh, man, it's just a little too much damage. I wonder if I should put the ener or the uh, yeah the energy artifact back on the Amon Ra in front and put the damage reduction on the back line because it feels like we really need that two layers the first round. Ooh, Carrie is just getting worked over now. Yeah, let's go try that out because it feels like that's just not enough survivability for round one. So let's come into here, take that off you. Granted, our slot one Amon Ra is going to take a lot of damage, but not the worst thing in the world. We can do this as well. Get a little more health on our girl right there. What am I looking for? Right there. Armor. Actually, you know what? Even carry, we should probably swap these out for 5 star for more HP. That looks good. We're not going to mess with anybody's stones really here. We're just going to see what a minimal, I say minimal, 2 E5s, but we're going to see what a minimal team in dark can actually get by with. So we have two layers from the first Amon Ra that should keep everybody healthy the first round. Perfect. That might be what we needed to do. Because now we'll get three layers from Amon Ra. Oh, Carrie's still going down. That hurts a lot. Aspen healing back up. That means Carrie comes back up as well. We need some good energy drain. Come on, Carrie. That's perfect. Doing her job. If only she was alive right here, though. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I feel like two Carrie is going to be the sweet spot here. One is okay, but honestly, dropping one Amon Ra back here for a second carry is going to kind of help us. It's going to help us keep that energy much, much lower on the enemy team. Need to get some lucky CCs here, some lucky energy drains. All right, come on, guys. You can do this. Hit that slot one warrior. Come on. No, you hit the wrong target. All right, but not too bad. I need you to hit the boss now. Come on, carry. Oh. So much of this is going to be RNG, I think, with this lineup. Just because it really depends on where Carrie hits. If Carrie hit the dragon right there, I think it would be pretty easy to get done. I am pleasantly surprised. Carrie is not going to be your solo carry like a DA will be in Dark. But as far as supporting, she's just as good as the baby Amon Ra's, that's for sure. Ooh, this one's not looking too good. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Oh, and you hit the wrong target, Carrie. We'll get one more round. We're not going to kill anybody, though, so RIP, guys. RIP. All right, let's see. Come on, let's get 17 down. I'd be happy if we can get that done tonight. Then later this week, or later these two weeks, we'll do more Heroic Scrolls. Uh, we're like 120 away from the actual... 400 scroll mark to get another carry but we might get lucky in the meantime that would be amazing if we could okay we're getting good petrifies be nice if carry can hit one of them in the front perfect all right and now carry i need you to hit that boss i need you that Oh, no. Okay, but still not bad here. We're getting a lot better RNG, that's for sure. Aspen should kill a target. Come on, carry. No, you need to hit that front target for me. But I think we're still good. Like I said, it's just going to come down to RNG. Please hit the boss. Oh, okay. Come on, Aspen. Kill the little guy. Good. There we go. We need some luck here. No luck. Oh, but we had Amon Ra shields. Perfect. And now, from here on, it should just be smooth sailing. The dragon will never get an active off, which means Aspen will just absolutely destroy him. Yes!
This feels good, guys. Sea Land 17 and Dark done. Like I said, I feel like this lineup can do a ton. It just comes down to the Amonrod petrifying the right people and Carry constantly hitting the one that has full energy and just zeroing it out. So if Carry can zero out the dragon right here, we have a good chance. Nope. Ooh, that hurts. Come on, Carry, right here, right here. Hit that slot one or two. One of them, one of them. You hit absolutely wrong person. <laughs> But as you can see, I mean, it's, it's oh, you, you see right there, Carrie's just hitting all the worst possible targets for us, but, eh, little RNG, little RNG, we can probably have it. We'll do a few, one more attempt here, and then we'll come back later tonight when we have a few more attempts and kind of combine the video together. The one thing that's a little rough with, uh, five stars, uh, I almost said scary. Five star carry is that her active ability only has that 20% chance down from 70% at E5 to put the, uh, what's it, the DM, the devouring mark on the enemy. So it's a little rough. We'll do some summons a little bit later and then we'll see maybe we'll get another carry and we'll jump back in it and continue. All right, guys, we are back. So let's just take a look. I don't think. We're going down P.O.'s anyway, the Profit Orb, so we're really not going to get anything there. Yeah, we really don't have anything that we can purchase right now that's going to give us any benefit. Um, what's this? Yeah, we need to catch up from the first day. I messed it up the first day. But that gives us more scrolls, which is great. Let's see if we can get another carry copy. We got 32 summons. Maybe we can get lucky. Not you guys. Oh, <laughs> guys. Am I lucky? Am I really that lucky? We just got another... We got another freaking carry. <laughs> this is absolutely amazing. So there's one of two things we can do here. Ooh, what's this? Oh yeah, more quests. Oh, which means we get more rewards. Oh yeah, I like to see it. So, like I was saying, there's one of two things we can do here. We First, we need to grab her out of her shard form, right? No, she'll be there. Never mind. What am I saying? I'm talking, I'm talking nonsense. There we go. Let's lock you. So there's one of two things we can do. First, let's try her using two different carries. If that doesn't work, um, maybe we'll make her a six star. Because I really don't plan on building her on this account. But getting her to six and then maybe even nine star and using her as food. I mean, yeah, I know, 9-star dark food, amazing decision, right, Barry? But it might help us in Seal Land. Even though I don't plan on using her, ooh, I don't know. First off, let's just try her. We'll drop out one of these Amon Ra, so let's grab the gear off you. Come over here, put the gear on carry, and then we'll, um, we'll give it a shot. So let's do Fearless. No, we don't want that. We want HP gear. There we go. So let's uh let's, let's make sure. So our last one is the one that doesn't have it. Um, let me check one more thing and we'll be right back. All right, let's just jump right back into this. We have 10 more attempts. Hopefully we can get a couple more down. So let's see, these two are definitely the ones that are geared. Let's try to carry. I'm hoping it works. I mean, round one, we're, we're draining energy on two targets. I mean, they both hit the dragon. That doesn't really help us. But we still have one up when we have that misfortune come up. So didn't drain energy there. But a lot of people live. This round is going to be really difficult. We did drain the active there, which was great. Um, I just don't know if we're going to have enough shields. And if it's, that's the case, I might just make... The carry a six star and maybe even nine star for a, a better active and survivability. I don't know. We'll have to see right here. Hopefully we get a little lucky with these oscillations. Nope. Yeah, that was really bad. <laughs> that was really bad. Oh, all right. All right. All right. Let's give a couple more tries. We might just go back to the Amon Ra. It seemed like the Amon Ra was better. Just waiting for that RNG. But we could level up the carry. Okay, we got some energy down there. That was really good. 
Like I said, it just might come down to pure RNG in this setup. Oh, perf. Oh, we hit the two that had actives. Oh, man. Carry is a really good support hero. We're just taking all their actives away. Perfect. Let's kill some. Now, come on, Carry. Come on. Drain that. No, you gave it energy. But I think we're good to go. Aspen should kill him right there. And we are golden. Yes. Look at this. Bye-bye energy. Bye-bye energy. Amon Ra still living. That's good. This round might be sketchy. Oh, but we got some luck. And now, come on, Aspen. It's your turn. Just start wailing on that dragon for us. Just keep chipping away. We'll keep draining the energy. That's what I like to see. Yes. Oh, man. See, we had 18. We've gone from 14 to 18. Simply because we got two more Amon Ra copies. And we have two carries now as well. That is awesome. I can't wait to start smashing dark, honestly. You know what the other thing is? On our meme team account, I might just keep any, you know, any of these girls, any of these carries around for a little bit. Push Sea Land with them instead of using them as fodder. We'll have to see. Okay, that was a good first round. Let's see some energy drain on this priest right here. Ah, But we're still in a good spot. We just really need to hit this dragon. Come on. Hit the dragon. Hit the dragon. Oh, yeah. You gotta hit the dragon. Absolutely have to. <laughs> There's no doubt about it. But hey, this is amazing that it's working on a team like this. Aspen's able to carry. This is crazy. If, if our Aspen was a DA, this would be absolutely ridiculously easy, I think. All right, let's get some luck with them carries. All right, yeah, we drained all the energy off the dragon in the back, which is perfect. Let's uh, let's hit these two targets right here. Come on, Carrie. Right here, right here. Yep. Oh, you didn't hit the boss, but you have one round to do it. Carries, you have to hit the dragon. Yes. Oh, double hit. That's perfect. We'll get more Amon Ra shields. We're going to slowly kill off some people. All right, we got to hit the dragon yet again. Come on, guys. Aspen, kill someone. Perfect. Oh, we only have one chance. And we got it. Yes. R and Jesus is with us. Come on, Carrie. Yep, keep that dragon energy at zero. Perfect. Just keep draining the energy. We're going to get close to the wire, though. We really... Come on, Aspen. You've got to start picking these guys off. Come on, Carrie. Come on. Yes. All right, Aspen, keep working. This is this is going to get tight because I don't know if we're going to have the damage at this point. Oh, we're not going to have the damage. This is going to go too long of a fight. Maybe Aspen's not getting hit with that Phoenix. Yeah, he just missed another Phoenix active. Three rounds I don't think is enough. Let's see, though. Maybe we get lucky. We got two more rounds of damage. Come on, Aspen. Come on. One more round. Come on, Phoenix buff. Phoenix buff, please hit Aspen. And come on, right here, right here. Oh, yes. Yes. Man, guys, I think we're putting on a clinic. I think we're put. I, should I just make this a guide for Dark Sea Land now? Use carry for support. Baby carries and baby rods carrying us all the way to Sea Land 20. Can we do it in one night? Go from Sea Land 14 to Sea Land 19? Maybe even 20. Come on, RNG, let's keep going. Ooh, that's not good. I'm gonna already Proctor Shield. Yikes. Alright, we drained all the energy again. Perfect. Ooh, one went down. It's gonna get a little rough, but we have both petrified, so let's uh let's focus on the dragon. Perfect. Man, it carries are just wherever I'm pointing, she's hitting. Come on, right, right here, carry. Aw, oh, one off. You're close. Oh no. Our main Amon Ra went down. That's going to be difficulty for us. Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> we might get lucky. You never know. Aspen keeps killing people. Oh, yeah. I don't think this is going to happen. Come on. Ah, oh, so close. Guys, I might buy some additional smashes tonight just to see if we can get this all in one video. This would be crazy. I can't believe we got the second carry today. Man, this is awesome. 
it, you guys can't see me because obviously we haven't done the face reveal, you know, live stream. I'm thinking like around seven or 10,000 subscribers, we might do a, a face reveal live stream finally, but I have a grin hitting like my ears. It's so big right now. I am grinning cheek to cheek right now. This is amazing. All right, let's give it a couple more tries. Oh, perfect. We drained the energy on the dragon, and that's the biggest difference. Ooh, but we still lost. We lost one, but she'll come back in one more round. So, come on. Energy drain. Energy drain. No, we're dead. <laughs> you just, you can't let that dragon even get one active off. Not even one. All right, come on. We need some really big RNG on this dragon right here. Ah, oh, and we missed it. <laughs> we only lost one Amon Ra, though. We did lose the uh, the baby carry, but not the end of the world since we have two and they revive. Yeah, we're not gonna last though. I don't think you got to hit that dragon. Nope, we're dead. <laughs> Do you like the play-by-play -play, like half a second before it actually happens? I'm just like, yep, I know what's happening. Just just do it already. Just do it. I think what we'll do is maybe buy like five more tries just to just to see if we can get lucky here. Come on, hit that priest. Ah. Okay, we only lost one carry. We got to hit the dragon though. I mean, it's a one in five chance. Probably really low. Yep. And there goes the whole team. The dragon is just too much damage, so let's do that. I'm doing five more. 150 gems, definitely worth it. Come on, we can do this. Ah, oh, man. We just gotta get lucky with that dragon in the back. I wish we had some more energy artifacts. I would probably preload all those Amon Ra's up with energy artifacts. No point wasting your time. Aspen's dead. Zero chance of us winning. I think we might be stopped here for now. I think we might need to build like a 9 star carry. And then also have another 5 star carry in this lineup. It just, I mean, honestly, though, it might just come down to attempting enough times. Like, right there, we finally got that dragon hit with the active, so we're good. We, now we need a carry to hit right here, slot one. No, it's not horrible. We're going to lose a couple, but now we have to hit the dragon again. And we did. Look at that. But we are losing Amon Ra's left and right. Aspen finally killed someone. Gotta hit the dragon again. Simple as that. And we did. And they're petrified. This this is becoming a chance right here, guys. Alright. Two chances right here. Yep, we got it. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. We gotta start killing targets, though. We cannot rely on RNG. Ugh, we keep getting the RNG, though. It's getting too late. Aspen's just not doing enough damage. Oh! Oh, I said that, but... Oh, no... Okay, no energy, perfect. I think we might have it. If Aspen gets lucky here, we have two rounds. We'll have a Phoenix active at this round. Can he do it with a single attack? Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Guys, the RNG. Oh, oh my goodness. Do you see this? Do you see this? We just went from Seal Land 14 to Seal Land 20 in one night, all because of five star carries. I know you guys have seen a lot of kills today, probably on Reddit, you know, with uh, E5DA and Aspen and all this other stuff using carries, even like an E5 carry. This just goes to show you. Right? Goes to show you. Yeah, I thought I said that wrong for a second. Just goes to show you, you don't need a high carry for Seal Land. You just don't. You just need your baby Ra and baby carry army with your uh, either a DA or an Aspen, and you're good to go. I cannot believe it, guys. Please, guys, hit that thumbs up. Share this video with everybody. Make sure you go to the Reddit post, because I'm going to throw it on Reddit, too. 
make sure it's thumbs up get it on that front page let people see how minimal of a team we just cleared seal and 20 in dark with this is crazy i know it's been done with just you know a e5 da but if e5 aspen can do it is there a point ever building an e5 da i don't know what do you guys think leave the comment below we're so close to 4,000 subscribers guys Please, if you have not subscribed yet, I know there's like 70% of you guys that are watching this video right now aren't subscribed. Help the channel out. Please support the channel. Hit that subscribe button. Leave a comment in last week's news video on Sunday for a chance to win up to five giveaways we're going to be doing probably tomorrow. So it's your last chance. And yeah, look forward to more Petrify Meme Team tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed this. You know I did. And I'll see you guys in the next one.